Good morning. I don't know where you are hearing my voice from. I pray for you. You are passing from pressure to power in Jesus' name. You don't seem to understand that many times when you are passing through some pressures, God is purposely orchestrated it for you to take you to the next level of glory. It is possible for a person to pass from pressure to power. If you read the book of Acts chapter 4, verse 31 to 33, the Bible says, And when they had pressured, when they had prayed, and the place was shaking, where they were assembled together, and they were all filled with the Holy Ghost, and they spake the word of God with the boldness, and with the great power, gave the apostle witness of the resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ. And the Bible said, the grace, grace was upon all of them. Now, it is possible for a man to pass through pressure. And thus pressure in Christ Jesus bring you power. It is possible for a person to pass from pressure to power throughout the scripture. There are men and women who pass through one season of great pressure and danger to the season of unusual fire and power. Yes. The early church, the apostles were once in prison, threatening never to speak in the name of Jesus anymore. From that realm of danger, intimidation, threats, problems, confusion, yet they move to a realm of power and fire, and the grace was all upon them. Look at the case of uh, Samson. Samson was once confronted by a lion. It was a season of great danger and threat, but he moved from that pressure to power. If you read the book of George, chapter 14, 5 to 6. Nobody would have heard about David without Goliath. Yes, Goliath was a threat, but he was a David connector. God is connecting you to somebody that will take to greater height in Jesus' name. Yes, Goliath is a David connector. That persecution, your marriage, that problem you are passing through, that problem of uh, embassy, that problem of uh, whatever you are passing through. God probably wants to use as a connector. And they breathe to your national power and a great influence in life in the name of Jesus Christ. You are moving from that uh, pressure to power in Jesus' name. Guriara was lifted, David life unknowingly, and destiny to another level. Hallelujah. Amen. So Daniel also had the same threats. Daniel was also threatened by one king called Nebuchadnezzar. Nebuchadnezzar dream. Nobody could understand. And he himself forget the dream. And now lay a death sentence on the wise, which Daniel also was involved. But look at that. The threat of elimination became the throne of elevation for Daniel. In the same chapter, Daniel was about to be killed by the king, Nebuchadnezzar. Same king make him a ruler and gave him presence. I pray for you. Whatever you are passing through this money, you are moving from that pressure to power in Jesus' name. From that pain to power in Jesus' name. From that grass to glory in the name of Jesus Christ. Your life will never remain the same. It is well with you. I pray for you. It's a new season. It's a new month. The Lord will do a new thing in your life. God bless you. It is me, Apostle and Prophet, at the fever. Father, good morning.